Hi, my name is John Hissick. I'm the boys varsity hockey coach at the Kingswood Oxford School in West Hartford. Uh, I, I grew up playing hockey in Cheshire in the old uh, School Street rink. Uh, I went on to play some additional uh, youth and high school hockey and then ended up uh, transitioning to lacrosse once I got to college. So when I first came to KO, I really didn't know what to expect. And I remember the first time I, I came home after a practice and I said to my wife, I said, geez, I said, I don't know how these kids have time to be kids because they are so organized and, and structured and, and either there from 7.30 in the morning till seven at night. And over my time here, the past eight years, what I've learned is that the education and the skills the kids are able to develop while here, they take with them for the rest of their lives. When these kids leave school, they are ready for college and there is no question as to whether or not they're going to be successful. I believe that hockey is a microcosm of life and I think that there are lessons that are learned by playing hockey that can be taken on to other aspects of life beyond school. Um, I'm looking for players that are, are dedicated, that have a good foundation of what the game is all about, um, have played up until this point, if at all possible, um, but also come with, with a, a, a toughness and a work ethic that is going to be commensurate with the level of hockey that we're playing at. I was asked what my coaching philosophy is relative to hockey, and I believe that um, teaching boys about having a strong work ethic, uh, having self-discipline, and an understanding of what it takes to get to the next level in, in hockey. We have many, many players that come to the school here looking to play hockey at the next level, whether it be junior hockey or in college. And I think that whole expectation starts here in understanding how they need to prepare themselves, how they need to practice, how they need to take care of themselves off the ice, whether it's nutrition, sleep, off ice workouts, or out of season workouts. You know, that really all starts here and we try to show them that that's the path forward and start that whole process and, and, and self-discipline now. I think sports in general teaches life lessons. Um, it, you have the moments of victory, you have the moments of defeat, you have to learn how to anticipate adversity and how you're going to deal with adversity in the moment and then learning how to handle those moments. We're all human beings, not everybody understands how to do the right thing in the moment. And what we try to do here is, is teach people how to handle those situations. I do believe that everything that's learned through sports at some point in time becomes a benefit to the student athlete once they move beyond school and they get out to the real world. And one of my favorite memories and, and things that I still look forward to now at, at KO during the athletic season is hockey night. Hockey night is, a, is a, an event that is set up to invite the entire KO community to come out and support the team um, and, and to really make it a special event. In past years, I remember that the sound levels and the cheering being at a deafening level. And to this day, if you ask existing hockey players here at school or those that have graduated and moved on, it remains one of their, their most fond memories while being here at KO. And I'm happy and proud to say that we've had many players that have gone on to the junior and to the college levels whether it's been a Division II, Division III, even Division I, believe it or not. Um, you know, players do move on from here to, to continue to play hockey. Uh, we put many players into the junior hockey level, which for those of you that are, that are part of the hockey culture, you understand that that's part of the path to going to college hockey. Um, so what we provide here is a foundation to prepare student athletes and players for the next level, whether it's college or junior hockey.